Welcome back to another video guys and gals hope you're loving yourself and getting through the days right before we begin I have a fiver opened up so if you feel like that interests you just check it out down below I just fucking decomputed I don't know what happened but today we're checking out Resident Vania gameplay Castlevania inspired by Resident Evil Village re their demake remake oh, I see what they did there no, I see what they did there <laughs> What happens when you combine Resident Evil and Castlevania? Well, you get this. Resident Vania by OCO. This free-to-download Resident Evil Village remake plays just like your favorite 2D Castlevania games of yesteryear, but with a Castle Dimitrescu twist. Here's some gameplay. Uh, bless me. Is he just not gonna attack anything? He's just gonna walk through it all? Just collecting all the ammo he can? Okay. For more Resident Evil, why not check these videos out? Okay. Right off the bat, I'm going to say, so it almost looks like Resident Evil Village is inspired by Castlevania because there's a castle in it and it's vampires. No, I'm just joking. But, okay. You know, I actually seen a comment before I started this video saying that it's like 1% Resident Evil and like 99% Castlevania. And um, my buddy or my sister, I think that's the point of this. It's inspired by Resident Evil, clearly Lady Dimitrescu and then the flying fucking sickle girl was one of the sisters. Like, I mean, clearly inspired, not exactly Resident Evil. Also, 
the start. You're in a winter ass, bleak, fucking barren winter wasteland, and there's the their castle. But you know, this is more than inspired. This is like a Castlevania, like literally a Castlevania. If Resident Evil was, yeah, Resident Residentvania, like it's literally. But they said 1% inspired. No, like the character designs are literally the pixel versions of them. So I have no idea what that comment was talking about. <laughs> but that's cool though. Um, I thought he was going to be able to talk to this guy right here. Isn't this the merchant? Let me see. Yeah, isn't this the merchant? Or like whatever the fat bear. What is his name? I don't know what his name is. But also what I was going to say when he um he seemed like whoever was playing seemed to know that they had to collect all this ammo for the end there or it looks like he's full on. It. No, it's right here. It's right here. Okay. Yeah, and he, I didn't even peep that little design right there. I seen the picture of Lady Dimitrescu, but I didn't even realize the sisters are right here. And it looks like these little shadows in the background are either her watching the character or like, you know, I can't really tell what it is. But, um, yeah, like her smoking the cigarette. Are these supposed to be like the werewolf dudes? This one didn't aggro for some reason. Nice little chandeliers. I don't know if you can actually interact with the background. I don't really know. But it, you know, what I was going to say was I don't know why this person was playing like a bot. I was like, yo, just kill the... It's a gameplay like dem demo, right? And they have the link down below where you could play yourself. But like, I was like, yo, kill some more of the enemies. It's just was gonna walk po past everything. Yeah, she's really like watching the entire time. That's a really creepy detail. Look, like, like what? Just kill it. Like, what the fuck? I was like, what the hell is going on? That was bothering me so much. <laughs> I don't know why. Okay, I'm lying when I say it bothered me so much. But it just was like caught me off guard and they seemed to know where like the stuff was so they ran through this before right had to have. let me see what happened did the window burst open I just wanted to see if the window burst open okay so like smacking that for some reason caused these to break but I don't even know if it was really him who did it. And then the sister appeared. Yeah, even like her little particles are like the... It looks really cool. But yeah, this part was way too pristine. Yeah, they were. They definitely ran through this before. Or just was probably not surprised to see that sh she didn't have like... I don't, I don't know. I was a little bit like why she can't attack back when you're doing this to her so you could like I don't I don't know you know like you know how usually an enemy goes into like an invulnerable phase where you gotta dodge a little bit I was like expecting that to happen but it didn't happen so yeah looks really cool though and then he gets his head absolutely demolished as it, look at this he absolutely gets just decapitated I wonder if she knocked it off with a baseball bat or something but I'm assuming that it, obviously this is not the full game, so they're doing a lot more. Looks really good though. Looks really, it looks definitely, it's definitely Resident Evil and Castlevania inspired. Like it's like a big 50 50. Because the, the castle, that's what it confused me. It's like about the person's comment is the Castlevania part is literally like the gameplay. Then the design of the game is like literally Resident Evil Village. But it looks really cool, it looks really good, it looks fun. Um, I never played a Castlevania game, but I've always seen them and watched them. I also like watching speedruns of them. I like watching speedruns of everything. Yeah. I also think the animation on that. I really don't know what I... You know, I'll still say it. Oh, the, the sound when this dude... Yeah, the sound when he was running was weird. Sounded like his hands were suction cupping, cupping the floor just a bit, just a bit. Not a big, big thing, but that caught me off. 
Also, not gonna lie, the animation of these motherfuckers is a little bit lazy. It's not like they're walking, they're kind of just sliding across the floor. But yeah, I don't know. Other than that, it looks pretty good. That's a cool game. Cool idea. Good on you guys. I will see you guys in the next video.